This historic election winding down with some polling places out east closing down in less than an hour from now. Here in Illinois, leaders in both parties expressing cautious optimism, having done all they can, and now the waiting begins. In Lakeview, Democratic Party leaders doing some phone banking in the closing hours of the election, trying to impact any last-minute voters who have not yet gone to the polls in Michigan and Wisconsin. Earlier, they carried out the Election Day tradition of gathering at Manny's Deli, expressing a certain level of hopefulness for a Kamala Harris victory. I'm cautiously optimistic. I've gone from sort of worried but <laughs> to cautiously optimistic. I, uh, I think that the difference in this election is going to be the votes of women. With interest in this election high in Illinois and throughout the country, lines at polling places remain long all day long. Voters determined to have their say in the outcome. Republicans hoping the economy will work in their favor. Everybody's hurting. Illinois families are hurting. Uh, workers are hurting. People are having to take uh, two or three jobs just to make ends meet. And uh, they see it at the grocery store, at the gas pump. Donald Trump voting earlier today, expressing confidence in his campaign. Look, I ran a great campaign. I think it was maybe the best of the three. Trump and Harris spending the final days of this campaign in Pennsylvania, considered perhaps the most important swing state. Harris stopping by the DNC headquarters this afternoon. We have all these volunteers here. You'd be really excited to know. There's just a lot of young people who are here. Illinois Democrats pointing to a concerted effort by volunteers to reach voters in Wisconsin and Michigan through Operation Swing State. After all the hours and days and weeks and months you put into a campaign, it comes down to this period of time when the polls are open and the voters have the last word as they should. I mean, I feel pretty positive. I mean, no matter what happens tonight, and my belief is that I think we're going to win this election. Now, there are varying opinions among Democrats about how long it might take to count the votes needed to project a winner. Some think it'll be tonight. Others more cautious, believing it could take several days to sort out the results. Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.